Hello my friends, in this video I show you how to fix the error 0x8007064 okay? uh, from Windows Update. You cannot update uh, the latest patch okay, of Windows, so it keeps getting an error and you cannot fix this problem. In this video I will show you how to fix, it's a simple uh, solution. This error uh, occurs because your recovery partition of your main hard, hard drive is destination just a small size and we need to enlarge the size to to fit the update okay so it's a simple uh, s simple steps how to fix this problem we go into google now and we're gonna download the program called wizard partition Tool free okay the you're gonna select this and you're gonna copy and go to google and type wizard partition Tool free and you hit enter okay you're gonna search for the mini 2 software okay mini 2 partition wizard free and you're gonna click here okay after you click here you're gonna see download the, the freeware we don't need the paid version we don't we just need the freeware version okay so you're gonna click it and you're gonna download the freeware i already downloaded here the free, the freeware already downloaded here and already installed okay you're gonna install and i'm gonna open the mini partition wizard okay so i'm gonna open here the mini partition wizard there's in the bottom right there will be a dialog box you just close it okay and here you're gonna search for your main hard drive you're gonna go to my computer and see which your main hard drive, the, my main hard drive, which is the drive that installed Windows, is the C hard drive, okay? So I'm gonna search here uh, for the C hard drive. The C hard drive is the disk number three, okay? You're gonna search here on the type of the partition. You're gonna search for recovery partition, okay? Which is very important. In the recovery partition, in the capacity of the recovery partition, the value here will be like uh, 500 megabytes, okay? So we're gonna extend this to 2.7 gigabytes, okay? So how do we do, we do that? You're gonna click here, okay? You're gonna, you're gonna select, you're gonna click here to select the recovery partition, okay? After you selected the recovery partition, we're gonna click here on the the up up left here. You're gonna uh, alter partition, change partition. You're gonna click here on extend partition. The, this option here, okay. You're gonna click on extend partition. In extend partition, uh, you're gonna see an option here. How many space do you you wish to occupate? Okay. Uh, you're gonna drag this 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 blue icon here to to left okay and you see here zero kbytes okay so you're gonna uh, just do a little movement to right you're gonna hold and do a little movement to right okay and you're gonna see that the partition will be increased in size 2.7 gigabytes okay in my case i already Change it and already up updated the partition, the recovery partition to 2.71 gigabytes. Here you can see my partition is already 2.71 gigabytes. But uh, in your case, if you're if you have just only 500 megabytes, you just click here, hold and hold to to right, and see the the option here 2.71 gigabytes. Okay. And after you set here to 2.71 gigabytes, okay, you're gonna click here in OK. After you click in OK, it will gonna try to increase the size of your recovery partition, okay? If could could not be, be made, you're gonna, gonna pop up a warning uh, with some options, like uh, you, you need to shut down your pc and turn it on again you're gonna uh, uh, you're gonna see uh, option number a which is to uh, automatically shut down your your computer and turn on again you're gonna 
go to click on the option restart okay restart and you're gonna click this option restart it will turn off your windows and then when your windows turn on again it will pop up um, uh, some writings okay and saying we're gonna we're gonna we are working to extend your driver your, uh, your recovery driver partition to 2.71 gigabytes you wait for five to six minutes and you're gonna uh, after that the your pc will shut down and turn on again after your computer turn on again it will it will uh, it will turn the windows again oh, you log on your windows again after you log on your windows after this work okay you're gonna click here on mini 2 partition just to see if your recovery partition is 2.71 gigabytes and you're gonna click here on your recovery partition and you're gonna see here on the capacity you're gonna see here 2.7 gigabytes which is the mo more than sufficient to the next update okay so you're gonna close the mini 2 partition 2 okay and you're gonna click here on the bottom left on windows logo and type update okay and after you type update, you're gonna search for update, okay? And then you're gonna click here, uh, see if there's any more updates. You're gonna click here, and then it will detect the new update, and it will begin to install. After this install, okay, uh, your your error will not be appear anymore and they will install the the update okay so you're gonna be free from the errors and your windows will be come back again okay so that's it i hope you enjoyed this video if you enjoy it and help it don't forget to give a like okay thanks goodbye people